Hello everyone, I'm Emily Rose. Welcome to my channel and so today I just wanted to show you how I got this summery bronze look for you. So if you would like to see how I done this, then just keep watching. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and take the CoverGirl Clean Sensitive Skin Face Powder and 255 Soft Honey. So I'm gonna use it kind of like a bronzer and I'm just gonna take it with a fluffy brush and blend it all over the eye. So I am going to take the Urban Decay Naked Flushed Palette and I'm going to take the bronzer in there and go over the top just to darken it up and just make it look a little bit more bronzier and I'm just going to also use a blending fluffy brush. Alright, so I'm just going to take a clean brush and just make sure everything is blended out. Okay, so I'm not sure where this palette is from, but I'm going to take the light shade and highlight my inner corner and also the brow bone just to add a little highlight in there. Alright, so I'm going to take the Flower Cosmetics palette in Foxy Browns and I'm just going to take that darker brown shade and apply that to my lash line just to give it a little bit more of a dimension. I'm going to take the Maybelline Unstoppable Eyeliner in Onyx and just tight line and waterline my eyes just to add that little bit of black because I like what it looks like on my eyes. just gonna curl my eyelashes and then I'm gonna pop on the Too Faced Better Than Sex mascara in black and I just like to coat these very well. take the Flower Cosmetics palette in Foxy Browns again and just take like a little angled brush that I used for the uh, upper lash line and just add a little bit of a dimension to the bottom lash line because I like kind of a smoky eye. Alright, I'm gonna blend that same CoverGirl 255 Soft Honey Powder in the Urban Decay Bronzer and just blend that under the eye to blend it out. Alright, so I am just gonna curl my top lashes again after I let the mascara dry and then I'm gonna also take the Better Than Sex Mascara and go ahead and just coat my bottom lashes. Sensitive Skin 255 Soft Honey Powder again and use that as bronzer and take it with a fluffy angled brush and add that on the tops of the cheeks, my forehead, and also my jawline. <laughs>
take the powder brush that I used off camera and just kind of blend it out so there's no harsh lines. This is just what I found that works best for me. Alright, so I'm also going to take the Urban Decay Naked Flush Palette Bronzer again and also add that on top of the other one and apply it to the tops of the cheekbones, my forehead, and then also on my jawline just to darken it up a little bit and just make ourselves look extra bronzy for that summer bronze. and just made sure everything was blended out as well. And then I'm going to take the Naked Flush palette and I'm also going to blend the bronzer and blush together for the blush and I'm going to take a smaller angled brush but I just done this because I didn't want it to look too pink but I wanted also that little bit of like sun-kissed look so I just thought if I blended the bronzer and the blush together it would give me that I'm also going to take the highlighter that's in the naked flush palette and just add that just kind of where the light would shine the Sun would shine on your face so I just kind of put it on the very high points of the cheekbones. Okay, so I used the Wet n Wild Lip Liner Gel in Gone Burgundy and I just kind of lined my lips, filled them in, and just blended them out a little bit and took a paper towel to pat them because I just kind of wanted a wash of color for like that summer look, but I always think that red lips is very summery-esque. And just so that way I didn't go overboard, I just want to get to look more like a lip tint or kind of like your lips are stained. It did turn out a little bit like you had lipstick on, but I still actually really liked it and I hope you guys did too. I'd like to thank you guys for watching this video and go ahead and check out some of my other videos on my channel and don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you!